to show you your happy new one. It sure is. If you, let's see what happens. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. Let's do something different. What can we do? Wink your eyes. Yes, good. If you are happy and you know it, wink your eyes. If you're happy and you know it, wink your eyes. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, wink your eyes. Let's do it. If you're happy and you know it, say If you're happy and you know it, say If you're happy and you know it, your face is gonna show it. If you're happy and you know it, say I think Bob Sink got Bill Gold's goat today. See, I read this funny story, and it was true. And this man said that he had some goats, and those goats were so smart, they learned how to the latch to get into the yard and then the door was not latched real good and he woke up one morning with the goat right by him looking right at him. Oh and my goodness. Him. He said he hadn't waked up with the goat breath in your face. You hadn't waked up. That's <laughs> 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 funny. A funny story. Oh, he got to wake up with a goat looking in there all that. <laughs> yeah. I, I tell you, I like goats. One time, I, me and Mr. Rogers, my husband, Mr. Rogers, we went riding and we looked out and there was a goat and he was standing from the very top of a car and he was looking all around like he was a king and I said he was the king of the cars. Oh, he was. And I had to see the top of that car when that goat got through with the no. horns all stopped all over. That's let's right. Do, I tell you what, let's do, let's do Bill Broken's goat. Okay. okay. That's a good one. That's, That's a good goat. one. And look, if, you, if you'll be, um, if you'll be the whistle on the trot. Okay. okay. All right. Here we go. Bill Broken's goat <laughs> was feeling just fine. He ate Bill's red shirt off the clothesline. Oh. Bill got a stick into the whack and gave him a whack, whack. And he tied that goat to the railroad track the road. Now the whistle blew woo -woo. and the train drew nigh. Woo -woo. It looked like Bill Brody's goat was gonna die. Come on, goat. <laughs> but he gave a moan. <laughs> of awful pain <laughs> and he coughed out the shirt and flagged the train. <laughs> 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 That's silly. That's silly. That well, I just had silly. something on my mind this morning because I read that funny story. Because you read that mm -hmm. funny I bet you can't guess what our story today is about. Little Red Riding Hood. I'll give you one more chance. <gasps> it's not a Little Red Riding Hood. Cinderella. It's not. It's got goats in it. So our story is yeah, well, there used to be an old timey sound story called the goat herd. It was a book about the goat about the little girls that might get herded goats. So was it the goat herd? It was not that one. But well, that sounds like a I good got, story. I got three chances, so I had to give up. Yup, you give up. Well, I guess you're just gonna have to wait and listen to the story. Okay, I'll do that. I'll, I wiggle my fingers and wiggle my toes, wiggle my shoulders, wiggle my nose. Okay. Okay. And then get all your wiggles out and sit down. Hold your hands and watch and listen again. Okay, are you sitting down ready to hear the story? Miss Maddie had three guesses and we sang about a goat and she had goats on her mind and she guessed three times and all three times it was not the right story. Have you guessed it yet? All right, let me tell you. Once upon a time, there were three billy goats. There was a small one and a medium one and a large billy goat. Now, these goats loved to run and play out in the grass in the fields and they were out one day eating the beautiful green grass and they had ate so much all around one spot they decided, you know what? Let's try another place. There's grass somewhere else that's bound to be greener. It's bound to look better. So let's go off and explore. So off they went to explore. They wanted to find a better place to eat. Isn't that funny? The grass is always greener on the other side. Miss Maddie found something in the tree. What was it? Ah. Oh. 
Well, off they went. And before long, they came to a bridge. And they looked at that bridge and said, oh, look across there. There's some more grass that we can eat. Let's go across the bridge. But what they did not know, there was a troll that lived under that bridge and he would let nobody pass across his bridge. The first little Billy goat started across. Now, Miss Maddie, can you do trip trap for me? Trip trap, trip trap, trip trap, trip trap. Who's crossing my bridge? said the troll. Oh, and the little Billy goat said, it's, it's me. I'm, I'm little Billy goat gruff. And he said, you are not going to cross my bridge. I will eat you. Well, that little Billy goat had to think fast. What am I going to do? I don't want to get eaten by the troll. And he stopped and he said, oh, Mr. Troll, just wait. My brother that's after me, he's a little bit bigger and you would have more meat with him. Please let me cross and wait for my brother. And the troll said, okay, I would rather a bigger goat anyway. You're too small and scrawny. Go on across and get out of here. Trip, trap, trip, trap, and he ran and got out of the way. A little bit later, here comes the middle brother. Trip, trap, trip, trap. <gasps> Who's that crossing my bridge? hollered the troll. <gasps> the middle billy goat was afraid and he said, it's just me. I'm the middle billy goat gruff. What are you doing crossing my bridge? No one crosses my bridge. I'm going to have you for supper. But, but I've got a big brother. He's a lot bigger than me. Wait for him. Please let me cross and just wait for my big brother. You can have him for supper. Hmm. There was a middle one and a medium. Ooh, I bet this big brother is really big. I'll wait for him. Go across and get out of my sight. Just go on. So he ran across the bridge and he got away. Well, a few minutes later, the big Billy goat trip trap. Who's that crossing my bridge? Well, the big Billy goat gruff was not afraid. He said, it is me. I'm the big Billy Goat Gruff, and who are you to stop me from crossing this bridge? I'm the troll that lives here, and this is my bridge. I will eat you for supper. And the big Billy Goat Gruff said, you will not. You have to come catch me first. That troll got up on that bridge, but he didn't realize how big Big Brother was. He got up on that bridge and said, you will not cross. And Big Brother said, yes, I will. And he popped him and he fell into the river. And on across went Big Brother Billy Goat Gruff. And they ate and ate and ate and had such a good time. And that troll never gave anybody another problem. The end. Woohoo! You yeah. see the horns on those? <laughs> I wouldn't want to be butted by a Billy Goat. I would not. Billy Goat's got really good horns on them. They do have horns on them. You know, that makes me think of a funny song that has horns. You talked about it one day. Does it eat purple people? The, the one eyed, one horn, blind purple people. Blind yeah. purple people. Does it eat purple people or is he purple? It, it, I don't know. I don't know. I think he eat us. Maybe you can find somebody tender enough. <laughs> We're too tough. <laughs> We're too tough. Let's sing about okay. the purple it's people later. Now, you know, everybody has to remember that, that this is the purple people. It's about this little man from outer space. Okay. And he came down. And you remember, I think he landed in that big old tree back there in the backyard. Oh. In the back of the library. And anyway, he's looking around. See, he, he, he didn't have horns like goats. He had this horn, like a musical horn, sticking about him. See, he'd come down trying to get him a job in one of those rock and roll things or one of those those uh, 
big band things that you go to, you know. Right. Like goes to and wave your hands. And all concert. All yeah, when in band concert. So he's going to try to get him a job. So so we're going to see what's going to happen. Okay. Are you ready now? Okay. Here we I'm go. ready. Here we go. Well, now we saw this thing coming. Remember? Out of the sky he had. Everybody do a great big horn and one big eye. Y'all do it. And Miss Laura's knee started knocking and she said, Mercy me. It looks like a purple people eater to me. And I looked out there and I said, I'll be John, what it is. Oh. Now we got to get the kids to help us with that. Okay, y'all gonna help. Everybody got to do it. It was a one eyed, one horned, flying purple people eater. One eyed, one horned, flying purple people eater. One eyed, one horned, flying purple people eater. Creeping up on me. I got you. Put your mind on